Razor Blade Show with Touch Knives, and we're going to hear all about that. Go for it. Well, here we have a dual action Sparrowhawk with the new Eclipse mechanism. Uh, it's a little bit different than everything else that's ever been done, and I'm kind of proud of it. And we've got patent pending. A little scale action. Several different openings. Uh, stop. <laughs> My hands are tired. Nice anno dub. These are custom, semi custom, mid tech, not quite sure what to call them. We uh, have some parts cut Damn. for us. Something we've never done before. We've always been a handmade shop. So um, I guess we've got someone on the band side, I guess you could say. Um, Blazer S30D, titanium liners, jewels, thumb stubs. Everything's um, everything is hand worked. We have an S30D blade with full polish. Um, don't quite know what else to say. So how long you guys been making knives? Well, I've been making knives about 15 years. Started out in Butch Valentin's shop learning how to make switch blades. My first knife was an assisted opener. My second knife was a dual action auto. Um, after about four months of being in the shop, which threw me out, and um, came home and built the shop. Been building ever since. Was um, in the art knife world for about 15 years, 14, 15 years, and that's where most people know me from, with very fancy, carved, fluted, polished pieces, lockbacks. Um, and recently, my son has joined me in the shop. And yeah, that's, that's where I started about five years ago when all we were doing was art knives. I learned lockbacks, doing the carving, the inlay, the very high-end fit and finish. Uh, from there, we started doing some liner locks and some flippers, and now we're gone full circle to doing some switch blades. And, uh, Do you have any is, future plans for other models? Uh, absolutely. Have, absolutely. Yeah. We have other models coming. We started out with a larger model than this uh, in hidden hardware. You know, double action, scale release, hidden hardware. I'm an idiot. Dumbest thing I've ever done, but it's very cool. This takes a lot of time to do. Um, then we scaled it down for the smaller sparrow hawk and put, a little, put some screws on the outside, still maintain the hidden hardware on the pocket clip. And um, we've decided to make a bunch of them. First time I've ever made more than one knife at a time. But tell us about this mechanism. You, you've been working on that a while. Yeah, we developed this mechanism um, about two years ago. A uh, client of mine asked me if he could have a knife with certain dimensions and a scale release and convinced me to be on a dare for me to do it. And I agreed and then figured out that no mechanism I had would work and had to come up with something else. And just had a little epiphany and started creating and cutting and filing and making itty bitty parts and put them all together and actually had something that worked. And it works really well. And I'm very proud of it. Well, it does work very well. Super fun little knives. Nice. Good job. Thank you. Thank you.